In this video, I will be telling you all the websites and extensions which will definitely help you and makes your competitive programming life much easier. So watch this video first and thanks me later. So before getting started, if you don't know me, I am Abhi Singh Chauhan and I have been doing competitive programming from past two years. Currently, I am expert rated on Core Forces and 5 star rated on Core Chef. So let's get started. So as many of the programmers do the practice on the code forces, I will be starting with the website code forces. So yes, at first, if you do practice on code forces, do install the extension name CF Analytics, right? So here is an web, here, uh, here is an extension, and it is free for the Firefox users and the Chrome users. So at first, you need to install it, and once you have installed this extension, uh, your profile will will look something like this. If I open my profile and scroll it down, yes, you can see the columns of the problem ratings and the tag solved and here the unsolved problems. How it is helpful, you need, you will get to know how many problems you have solved for the particular rated. If I check for the 2000, I have solved the 50 problems and for the 1700, I have the 90 ones. So like I can set a target like I have to solve the 100 problems for the 1700 ratings and then I will move up, move to 1800 and similarly with further on like uh, and if I move down I will be getting to know like which topic I am good at like I have solved the majority of the questions in the topic of maths and greedy and if I check for the flows FFTs like Chinese similar theorem like I am weak at it so it is also showing that and here is a count of the problems which I am not which I haven't solved it like I have a wrong answer on them right so this is the first extension which is very very helpful while doing the practice so if I move further like many of the programmers have the habit of doing uh, giving the contest like solving the full full contest like do not doing by question by question but solving the full contest in one go so let me open it the second website right? let me close this and yes let's move on to second website uh, here is a website named the Code Forces Virtual Selector Contest Selector, right? This website will letting you know like which contest you haven't solved yet. So if I write my username right up here, 27, and add up here, right? Now here is a column which contest do I need to solve? Let's suppose I have to solve the contest of division 2 and it will show and click on show. It will show all the contests which I have haven't solved single question right if i open the contest name let's suppose uh, 416 okay it will open the new tab and it will i haven't solved a single question of that contest so i can start a virtual contest or i can absorb this con contest in any way so here is a second website uh, named cfvs.github.io all the links will be in the description do check it out right so this is the second website who, who solves the full contest or who finds the uh, virtual contest like contest to give as a virtual right. So let me close this one also. So let's move on to second uh, website which is uh, like this is a website for the persons who solve the questions by question like who finds the question and then solve it right. So yeah let me just show it up. So this is a third website related to code forces yes. And at first you have to input your handle here to seven and login. So it will take some time and login. The website is tom0727.github.io cf problems, right? So here are some options which contest you have to check which problems you are have been solved, right? So if I check for a division two, it will right up here, it will show all the contest name. And these are links like I can visit to that contest like this is a 555 and here is a contest link. So it will show which contest I have solved and how many question of that contest I have solved right. So like I have to solve and I have to up solve any contest like I have given the round 751 and I have to solve up solve the problem D. So I can visit uh, from here and find the con questions which I have to up solve right. You can see like many of the question I have absolved till E and something from D. Uh, some of these which I haven't solved can be of like topics which I don't know. So still, this is this website is very helpful and you can definitely uh, just bookmark them and it will help you in the future, right? So if I check for the division threes, so here's a division threes like till F and all the question which I have solved, right? 
so similar website is for the code ad coder also and we will be discussing that things in the ad coder section and here's division one plus division two and ed educational round and the global rounds right so this is the second or third website right let's move on to next website this site will help you during the contest or while absolving or while practicing on any of the platform when the problems come related to graphs so at first i will be showing a question related to graph which is uh, this and in this question like i will directly move on to inputs like the inputs are u v n w and u or v are the vertices and v w is the length of that vertex like you can say the endpoints of the roads the city 1 city 2 and the length between the road is 1 and city 1 and 3 length between the road is 3 but here is no diagram in the explanation like how would you get to know like how is this graph is represented so like in this case you have to need a copy pen and you have to draw it and then you have to realize and pictureize this inputs right but here is a simpler way to do is uh, this website uh, this is by cs academy a graph editor so if you just open this website and copy the inputs which are these five inputs for the uh, uv and w and if i copy and paste right up here and here you will get the graph bingo and it will save your time it will like one two and the length is one it will showing one to two uh, graph node one and node two the length is one it is showing that one and three the length is three and it is showing that and let's suppose you have to do compare two graphs which is like uh let's suppose their names can be in the alphabets also like a and b their distance is five right you can like put up here and fix a like i'm fixing a so that they might not merge okay that's cool let's suppose and b and c let's suppose a 10 so it will also include that and let's suppose now c and a of length one okay that's cool so here have we have two graphs and we can just compare them okay so we can include and many of them right cvv and here i can just tell b cool right so yes this is our second web uh, our fourth i guess in the fourth in a number which is graph editor and this is very very helpful during the contest like i have taken the example from the code forces contest it can be from the ad coder hacker Earth, or code forces any of the website any of your favorite programming website so now it's time to include our uh, one of the best platform for the uh, for the programming contest name ad coder a super cool platform and extremely good problems but if you check out their website it is like bit confusing okay let me just open their website just a minute uh, it is like opening right yeah here it is uh, like if you are visiting their website uh, at the first time you might not get any of the problem set right up here like uh, here is an here uh, this is the home page of the ad coder and you can check out for the act active contest the permanent contest upcoming recents and here's the rankings right there is no column for the problem set where would you like absorb the problems and uh, like practice it right so here is a website named ad coder problems like i have shown on the screen uh, i hope it is visible right let me check first yeah it is visible so in this website at first you have to enter your username right i have entered my username 27 and now you can visit all the websites like in the code for code forces same as right and all the questions you have solved or you haven't solved right all the questions right which you have solved or not and here is a feature called rival id so you can just uh, compare your rival right let me uh, let's suppose i have i am been entering my seniors id kenichi and now i will be comparing my progress with them as right now i have solved many of the problems but the red problems are those which are solved by them and but not my not by me right so here i can compare my progress and uh, i can solve these kind of problems right so like they are solving from the back but uh, i have solved more of the recent problems right so cool so this is the website for the ad coder so now uh, let's move on further now like i have been talking about the ad coder contest so here comes the point when you fail on the test cases right okay let me show you out 
let's suppose like i was giving the contest uh i guess the uh the past two contests right and i failed only two test cases and there is no option like code forces where you can check out these two test cases which test case i am wrong at right while you were up solving you need to know like which test cases i am wrong so this is like an frustration frustration moment like i am not getting the edge cases and what should i do right so yeah so here comes the uh, easy way like the thing the website which can solve this issue is this the dropbox this is maintained by the ad coder itself here you will get to uh, get to see all the edge cases all the test cases of the recent contest like here are all the contests and if i open one of the abc abc means ad coder beginner contest right the recent is 232 if i open it and it is loading like which questions which question you are checking at let's suppose i am checking the question a and question a inputs are in this folder and outputs are in this folder if i open the input folder and i will be getting all the inputs for the test case for the question 1 and if i open a single input file and it will look like something like this okay i think it is downloaded right okay it is it is not downloaded uh, i think it is yeah it is taking some time so yeah it is the here is an input like okay cool so you can okay okay it is been it is a test case 2 here is an out input for a test case 2 and let me move on test case 3 right so this is like you can definitely book in, bookmark it like i have also bookmarked some of these websites right so if you check it out like uh, i have closed them okay cool so i have also bookmarked this website like here is a dropbox here is an ad quarter problems right and for the cf i have the cf virtualizers uh, virtual right so you must bookmark and this will definitely help you in the future so if you need some of more of your practice trackers you can here is in one more extension which i can show for you named cf code forces practice tracker right uh, this you can also install on uh, chrome or firefox yes once you have installed this extension uh, the link will be in the description right so you can see the stats over here a red color icon so from here you can check it out right how many problems you have solved the past month and how much rated and the back the major rated the count of the problems right you can check it out by yourself like it is an additional practice tracker which you can just uh, maintain yourself like how much you are growing okay cool so apart from this uh, okay let me come back and i will be here i will be discussing the last of the website which is super cool named c list uh, this is the main website you need to know because you might miss any contest right uh, here, this website contains all the contests which is going on and like hash code is coming you can register it out and today in approx 2 hours there is a code for this contest goodbye 2021 and it is showing it right so you can definitely check it out this website daily and you can you will get to know which contest is definitely coming up right now and yes you can definitely book out bookmark the main of the links like i have bookmarked the main link here upcoming so for the code for code chef contest i will click this link in the morning and i will be get to know like which contest i have okay i have not been signed in okay which contest uh i i have been uh, like which contest is upcoming in like this link definitely uh directly uh, push me up to the upcoming contest for the code forces core chef right and this is a mashup link which i create the mashup for the virtuals and some of like this is my cp template link which uh, where i have all my templates right uh, yes you can like check it out but it is recommended to build your all time all uh, on template here is a lead code like this is a link which directly push you towards the daily problem for the lead code right it will help you a lot again right some of the links like these things uh, makes your life easier when doing when you are doing competitive programming cool so this was it for today's uh, video and i hope this all the information of the extension and the website helps you a lot and you will be definitely bookmarking it and the credit goes to all the creators like the cs academy or the any of the author like who have uh, code this extensions and the website right so yes 
and do upsolve and do keep doing the contest till then we will meet in the next video with the new educational content and till then happy coding and bye